Assalamu alaikum Ya Sayyidi Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullah Please forgive me and my ignorance Sayyidi, did all the prophets on Sayyidina Muhammad's night journey reach their seven heaven reality maqam al -ihsan? I can't speak to the prophets of Allah <laughs> but I can tell you they, they completed their deen because the Isra and the importance we say of Isra is that in the Qur'an Allah gives a disclaimer to all who will represent him of nubuwat and risalat that if at any time Sayyidina Muhammad comes in your time you agree to follow. وَقَالُوا بَلَى Because this is the supreme representation of Allah So then Allah granted Isra because that was predestined, why? So when Prophet appeared at Al-Aqsa, 124,000 Prophets and Messengers of Allah appeared and prayed with Prophet behind their Imam. So he's the Imam of all the Prophets and they prayed the Muhammadan prayer. In Tahiyyat they had to say, Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah wa ashhadu anna Muhammadan Rasulullah. And Prophet accepted their shahada and granted them Islam. And as a result, all nations are under the flag of La ilaha illallah. Muhammadun Rasulullah they can't be anything other than that. Because if they say, no, no we follow uh, Sayyidina Isa, well Sayyidina Isa was there and he took his shahada and he prayed with Prophet So when the Prophets entered all their nations automatically are dressed by that and as a result Allah says, the only deen of Allah is Islam. And that's why in the last days we're seeing what we see. There's no deen left on this earth except Islam. The other one says he's waiting for a human being to be God is a mushrik, it's outside of religion now. The other cousin he's waiting also for a messiah that will call himself God, that's a mushrik. Great battles have opened upon the earth and its purpose is to take Al-Aqsa. The only reason anything is happening right now on the news is because their Messiah is here and the Messiah has to declare and build the temple. Al-Aqsa has to be taken for them. So these are immensely important days that are opening, all of which are the signs of Qiyamah. So we said before their Messiah has arrived and the Messiah before he can proclaim who he is must have control of the Temple Mount so that they can build their temple. The events that are taking place in the news today are calculated events for the purpose of that goal only. So we're living in astonishing times. Day by day you'll open something new will be happening upon the earth. Only thing important is keep your heart connected with the love and ishq of Sayyidina Muhammad Subhana rabbika rabbil izzat amma yasifoon wa salaamun al mursaleen walhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Bi hurmati Muhammad al-Mustafa wa siri Surat al-Fatiha. As Salaamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This is Shaykh Narjan, thank you for watching the video that you're watching. InshaAllah if you're happy with the content and happy with these programs. Please support the button below the programs that we have for our orphanage repairs, our water well, give the gift of life, our mobile food vans. We have now five vans, Vancouver, Chicago, Los Angeles, Pakistan. There's many programs that reach thousands of people and rescue foods and give those supplies to people in need. Your support is greatly appreciated. Also. Be so kind as to leave uh, loving comments and please share the stream, every bit counts. As Salaamu Alaikum Warahmatullahi Wabarakatuh.